In this video, we're going to take a look at the library. This is the first screen you will see when you open up the Words on Screen Synchronise Player. Here, you can navigate around your songs, create playlists and store your e-songbooks. As this is just an introduction to the library, we've made separate videos to explore these features in more detail. This window contains all of your music. Here you'll find the song title, the writer, as well as some useful information, such as category, age range, song length, and the corresponding e-songbook. We've made it super simple for you to find what you're looking for. By default, all of your songs will show in alphabetical order. But if you click on the age column, for example, the songs will sort into age order. Clicking again will reverse this. You can do this for any of the categories and you'll notice that the arrow shows you which column you have selected. Let's click back on the song column. The preview window gives an overview of the song you have selected, like this. This button allows you to toggle through the pages of the song and you can also hide this by clicking here. But I'll keep the preview window open for now. On the left-hand side of your screen, you can also click on any of these options to show the songs you have recently added, recently played, or the songs you use the most. If you're looking for a specific song, you can type the name here. You can also search using keywords or lyrics. For example, if you're doing a project on Harvest, you can search using this keyword and it will display any songs containing a match. Let's pick uh, Harvest Samba. When you're ready to sing, remember to switch back to the player view for full screen. There's a whole series of videos you can check out for more information on words on screen.